What? I'm ready to make pizza. Okay. Well, let's do it. What's this stuff called? Um, what? Semolina flour. Semolina. Why do we use semolina? It does two things. What two things do you think it does? It helps the bottom of the pizza have, it helps the bottom of the pizza stay white. It helps the bottom to stay, to have little spots on it. And the most important part, it lets the pizza dough not be able to stick to the twin. Exactly. Exactly. You want to turn it over and get semolina on all sides of it right there, okay? And then we don't touch the outside, right? We just keep pressing on the inside. And working it. Do you want to press on the inside a little bit? And see how it's getting bigger while you press on it? See how we're keeping this side nice? That's called a cornice right there. And we, so let's turn it around a little bit. And we, we want to keep that cornice, because know why? Because it makes it really puffy and the crust gets really nice. Want me to keep helping you? Watch this. You know, have you ever been to a pizza shop? Well, sometimes when they have a pizza shop, they take pizza in there this like this and they go like that and throw it up in the air <laughs> and throw it up in the air <laughs> and that makes the pizza stretch okay here we go are you ready to make a pizza I'm gonna just keep stretching it out a little bit there nice and round huh okay okay now I want to do the sauce spread it around Need just a little bit more of there, like that. How's that look? You ready to put your toppings on? Uh -huh. Okay. What do you? What do we put on first? Cheese. Cheese. You're a genius. We, we put on sauce first, and then the toppings, and cheese first, and then we do pepperoni. <laughs> Okay, I think we'll take a picture of your finished pizza for your mama. How's that? Okay, what's this stuff called? Um, pepperoni. We do. The last part is we eat the pepperoni. Okay, what's next? On your pizza. Oh, yes. What's this stuff called? Sausage. All right. You know what, Benson? I think you're probably the most talented four-year-old pizzola I've ever met. Smile so I can send your mama a picture. Okay, we'll keep going. We'll keep going until it's finished, all right? <laughs> Putting onions on your pizza at four years old. No, you're gonna have a whole pizza here in just a minute. So that's enough, enough pepperoni. Okay, oh, I know, just be grumpy. You think? Okay, ready? You ready? Okay. Come on, let's go cook it. All right, let's see what the temperature is. 730. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, here we go. Pizza launched. Turn the fire down. There's your pizza. That you made. You can? Is it ready? Yeah, look. What do you think of that? Great! Let's go eat it. Let's go eat it. I'm so hungry. Go get in your seat.
We had some good crunch on that. Here you go, Mr. Benton. You make the best pizza in the world. How good that pizza looks. Did, did you like it? Uh-huh. I don't like the pizza. <laughs> World's youngest pizzola. Look at that. Mm. <laughs> That's some mozzarella.